the top 10 biggest dogs in the world. Everywhere you look, there is a strong desire for huge things. You would think that the fixations with the world's largest canines is solely about size. However, anyone who has devoted their heart to these gentle giants, whether a dog owner or a pet care expert, would be the first to tell you that this is not the case. Despite their huge look, giant breed dogs are often well-tempered, affectionate, easygoing, and devoted animals. Throughout history, these dogs have been utilized for their power to protect animals, secure territory, and hunt. The cost of adopting any types of dog or one huge dog is an important consideration. Food, veterinary bills, grooming, and space are all included. In general, purchasing a huge dog will cost you a little extra in the beginning. There are nevertheless wonderful family pets who get along well with children and other home pets. In addition to their larger stature, the world's largest dogs are often the sweetest, bred for even temperaments, and have larger than life dog the IQs. Here, you will know about these top 10 biggest dog breeds in the world. Here we go. Number 10. Greater Swiss Mountain Dog Nicknamed Swissy, these faithful, family-friendly draft and drover dogs are large yet agile and possess immense physical strength and power. Thought to have descended from local Swiss dogs mated to Mastiffs, these dogs can top 150 pounds and also have larger-than-life litters of up to 18 puppies. Greater Swiss Mountain Dogs have an animated and gentle expression. Their eyes are almond-shaped, vary in color from hazel to chestnut. Dark brown is preferred. Medium size and neither nor protruding eyelids are close fitting and eye rims are black. The Greater Swiss Mountain Dog is happy with an enthusiastic nature and strong affinity to people and children. This breed is sociable, active, calm, and dignified. While the breed does need exercise, they do not need a fast pace. The breed often stands close to their owners, rarely straying far away without checking in. They will not be happy confined to kennel life. They want to enjoy their family. They crave attention and physical contact. Greater Swiss Mountain Dogs are both faithful and willing workers and are eager to please. The Greater Swiss Mountain Dog is confident in nature. The breed is gentle with children. They can be stubborn and determined. The Greater Swiss Mountain Dog is an intelligent breed and is a quick learner. The activity level in the Greater Swiss Mountain Dog is variable. They are capable of being athletic, but usually that activity is in bursts. They are active for short periods of time followed by napping. They want to be with their owner and to participate. Their activity level most often matches the activity level of the family. As a working dog, they like having a job to do and enjoy participating in hiking, carting, obedience trials, herding, weight pulling, and backpacking with their owners. Number 9. Newfoundland The Newfoundland's extremely large bones give it mass, while its large musculature gives it the power it needs to take on rough ocean waves and powerful tides. The Newfoundland is known for its calm and docile nature and its strength. They are very loyal, have a mild nature, and make great working dogs. It is for this reason that this breed is known as the Gentle Giant. International kennel clubs generally describe the breed as having a sweet temper. The breed typically has a deep bark and is easy to train if started young. They are wonderfully good with children, but small children can get accidentally leaned on and knocked down. Newfoundlands are ideal companions in the world of therapy and are often referred to as nanny dog. A Newfoundland's good, sweet nature is so important. It is listed in the breed standards of many countries. Dogs exhibit poor temperament or aggressions are disqualified from showing or should never be used to breed. The breed standard in the United States reads that sweetness of temperament is the hallmark of the Newfoundland. This is the most important single characteristic of the breed. Exquisitely patient and calm nature, Newfoundlands have thick, heavy coats in keeping with the northern climes of their origin. They are gentle giants of tremendous strength, used often for water rescue due to their muscular strength, water-resistant fur, webbed feet, and excellent swimming ability. Number 8. Scottish Deerhound the Scottish Deerhound is best described as a large greyhound cloaked in a wiry coat. The breed has the typical greyhound family traits of long, slender legs, relatively narrow body, deep chest, tucked abdomen, arched loin, and long tail. The Scottish Deerhound, known for their intelligence and ability to gallop at a fast clip. This breed was once linked to Scotland's nobility, bred to hunt red deer. Scottish Deerhounds are gentle, friendly, and loving. They are formidable in size but not quite as tall as their Irish cousins. Scottish Deerhounds love to launch. They are laid back, even lazy. They watch the world go by with good-natured amusement as thought it were a show arranged for their entertainment. That is, until something worth chasing happens by. Then the Deerhound is transformed into a running hunter, coursing after his fleeing prey in single-minded pursuit, not to return until the chase is complete. Obedience lessons are apt to be met with a sense of humor and an I'll get back to you on that attitude. 
This attitude is not a dominance issue, but rather an inability on the dog's part to comprehend the point of it all. Give a deer hound a reason to perform, however, and he will be more than willing to please you, even if it is in a somewhat lackadaisical fashion. Like most sight hounds, Scottish deer hounds are very sensitive one family dogs. They are friendly, but not gregarious, towards strangers. As a watchdog or protection dog, they are quite hopeless. Number 7. Black Russian Terrier the Black Russian Terrier is high energy and smart. These powerfully large dogs will protect people they love with everything they have. Large bone and muscled, Black Russian Terriers are courageous and reliable. Males often reach 150 pounds and females reach 130 pounds. The Black Russian Terrier is a calm, confident, courageous, and self-assured dog, although they can also be stubborn and lazy. He is highly intelligent and adapts well to training. The Black Russian Terrier was initially bred to guard and protect. He is alert and responsive, instinctively protective, determined, fearless, deeply loyal to family, is aloof and therefore does not relish intrusions by strangers into his personal space. Shyness or excessive excitability is a serious fault. If you have a family with children, the Black Russian Terrier is a great fit for it. They are great companions for children since they have a strong guarding instinct toward children. Female Black Russian Terriers have more patience and will to play with children, but both sexes get along well with children. High energy and smart, these powerfully large dogs will protect people they love with everything they have. Large bone and muscled, Black Russian Terriers are courageous and reliable. Males often reach 150 pounds and females reach 130 pounds. Number 6. Bernice Mountain Dog Big, powerful, and built for hard work. The Bernese Mountain Dog is also strikingly beautiful and blessed with a sweet, affectionate nature. Burners are generally placid but are always up for a rum with the owner, whom they live to please. The Bernese Mountain Dog is a large, sturdy worker who can stand over 27 inches at the shoulder. The distinctive markings on the coat and face are breed hallmarks and combined with the intelligence gleam in the dark eyes. Add to the Burner's aura of majestic nobility, a hardy dog who thrives in cold weather, the Burner's brain and brawn help him multitask on the farm and pastures of Switzerland. Burners get along with the entire family and are practically gentle with children but they will often become more attached to one lucky human. Burners are imposing but not threatening, and they maintain an aloof dignity with strangers. Bernese Mountain Dog is an extremely versatile working dog from the farmlands of Switzerland. They were developed to herd cattle, pull carts, and be watchdogs and loyal companions. They are one of four types of Swiss Mountain Dogs, and the only one with long hair. The Bernese Mountain Dog comes from the canton of Bern, hence their name. They are a large and sturdy dog breed with a friendly and calm dis disposition. They are also well-suited to conformation, obedience, tracking, herding, and carting competitions. This large Swiss mountain farm dog breed is even keeled, strong, and good-natured, a slow maturing breed. These dogs don't reach full size until they are 3 years old and are typically longer than they are tall, often reaching 110 pounds at full maturity. If you're enjoying the video so far, do us a favor and smash that like button as we move down the list. Number 5. Cane Corso The Cane Corso, also known as Italian Mastiffs, these hunting guard dogs are calm, quiet, and big. An intelligent, athletic breed, Cane Corsos can hit 27.5 inches at shoulder height and weigh in at around 120 pounds. The Cane Corso is a working dog who absolutely loves having a job to do. This old Italian dog breed was developed to guard property and hunt big game such as wild boar. Although these are purebred dogs, you may find them in the care of rescue groups or shelters. Remember to adopt! Don't shop if you want to bring one of these dogs home. Smart, trainable, and of noble bearing, the assertive and confident King Corso is a peerless protector. Their imposing appearance is their first line of defense against intruders. As one writer put it, an understated air of cool competence, the kind of demeanor you'd expect from a professional bodyguard, is the breed's trademark. Corsi are intelligent, loyal, eager to please, versatile, and intensely loyal to their humans but are also assertive and willful and can end up owning an unwitting owner. As with any other big guardian dogs, responsible breeding and early socializations with people and other dogs is vital. Number 4. Saint Bernard The Saint Bernards, the genial giant of the Swiss Alps, is nonetheless among the world's most famous and beloved breeds. Saints are famously watchful and patient nanny dog for children. Not ranked particularly high in AKC registrations, this genial giant is nonetheless among the world's most famous and beloved breeds. The Saints' written standard abounds with phrases like very powerful, extraordinarily muscular, imposing, and massive. A male stands a minimum 27.5 inches at the shoulder, female will be smaller and more delicately built. The huge head features a wrinkled brow, a short muzzle, and dark eyes combining to give saints the intelligent, friendly expressions that was such a welcome sight to stranded alpine travelers. 
despite the iconic renditions of these huge alpine rescue dogs and their ever-present neck cacks of brandy. St. Bernard's, bred for centuries to rescue wayward travelers, are not bars on four legs. They didn't actually carry those brandy barrels around. But this fictionalized tall tale can be traced back to the work of a British painter in the 1820s as mental floss details. What they do bring with them at all times is massive girth, a superior sense of smell and fast strength. Number 3. English Mastiff Full-grown males start at 30 inches tall and can weigh as much as 200 pounds. Females start from about 27 inches in height and weigh around 150 pounds. The Mastiff is a dignified yet good-natured animal. He is loving and affectionate towards his family, and his calm demeanor makes him a good companion for older children. However, the breed is not recommended for toddlers because of its great size. Mastiffs are patient, lovable companions and guardians who take baths to gentle training. Eternally loyal Mastiffs are protective of family, and a natural wariness of strangers makes early training and socialization essential. Mastiffs are magnificent pets, but acquiring a powerful giant breed dog is commitment not to be taken lightly. They may not be the tallest, but these huge canines are some of the most massive dogs ever known. Gentle and sweet, the black mass canines are known for their huge heads and large bodies. Number 2. Great Dane Great Danes are huge, powerful, and elegant dogs. Male can reach 32 inches tall and weigh anywhere from about 100 to 120 pounds, which females may be 30 inches tall and weigh about 100 and 120 pounds. Great Danes are considered gentle giants. They are moderately playful, affectionate, and good with children. They will guard their home. Great Danes generally get along with other animals, particularly if raised with them. But some individuals in the breed can be aggressive with dogs they do not know. Great Danes are considered easy to train, but some Great Dane fans here say that individuals can be stubborn learners. Great Danes have earned the reputations of being the tallest dog breed in the world. Their height can reach about 76 until 87 cm, while their weigh between 54 until 90 kg. Danes were firstly bred for hunting purposes, although over time they have become exceptional companion dogs. Great Dane is one of the most dangerous dogs in the world. Number 1. Tibetan Mastiff The Tibetan Mastiff is a large-sized Tibetan dog breed. The dog of Tibet are twice the size of those seen in India, with large heads and hairy bodies. They are powerful animals. During the day they are kept chained up, they are let loose at night to guard their master's house. The name Tibetan Mastiff is a misnomer. As the breed is not a true Mastiff, the term Mastiff was assigned by the Europeans who first came to Tibet because that name was used to refer to nearly all large dog breeds in the West. Early Western visitors to Tibet misnamed several of its breeds, such as the Tibetan Terrier, which is not a Terrier, and the Tibetan Spaniel, which is not a Spaniel. A better name for the breed might be the Tibetan Mountain Dog. Originally, they were used to protect the monks and Tibetan monasteries from animals such as bear and snow leopards. Its double coat is medium to long, subject to climate, and found in a wide variety of colors including solid black, black and tan, various shades of red and bluish gray, and sometimes with white markings around neck, chest and legs. The Tibetan Mastiff was able to adapt to the extreme highland conditions of the Tibetan Plateau very quickly compared to other mammals such as the Yak, Tibetan Antelope, Snow Leopard and the Wild Boar. The Tibetan Mastiff's ability to avoid hypoxia in high altitudes due to its higher hemoglobin levels compared to low-altitude dogs, was due to prehistoric interbreeding in 2020. Alright folks, congratulations on making it to the end. These are the top 10 biggest dog breeds in the world. These are the world's largest canines is solely about size. However, anyone who has devoted their heart to these gentle giants, let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and turn on post notifications to see more of our future videos. With that said, thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you in the next video.